and welcome to the Salvation Army of Gwinnett County. We are so glad that you've joined us for worship this morning. If this is your first Sunday, I want to remind you that we have a free gift for you. You can pick that up in the gym on your way out. Just see Roberta and she'd be glad to give that to you. I want to give a special shout out to all of our volunteers and staff who helped us with our back to school bash yesterday. It was a tremendous success where we saw hundreds of people here on our property and had the opportunity to engage with them and interact with them. If you are new here this morning as a result of our back to school bash, we want to give a special welcome to you as well. It's hard to believe that it's August already, but here we are ready to jump into our fall programming this month. We're gonna kick things off on Sunday, August the 18th with our Back to Church Sunday. And this is gonna be an exciting day. We've got a lot of things planned for this. You can see on the screen, we're gonna be having breakfast at 9.15, and we're gonna have a program showcase. This is gonna be an opportunity for us to share with everybody who walks in through these doors all of the amazing ministries that they can be a part of here at the Salvation Army of Gwinnett County. So it's going to be an exciting morning followed by an exciting morning of worship as well at 1030. This is going to be a Sunday that's geared towards the newcomer so we want to encourage you to invite your family and your friends who may not have a church home. We'd love to have them here on Sunday August the 18th for Back to Church Sunday. And then our fall programs kick off that Wednesday, August the 21st, with our worship and discipleship programs. We have programs from nursery age all the way up through adults, so there's something for everybody that night, as well as on Thursday, August the 22nd, when our music and creative arts programs start. Again, something for everybody of every age on that night as well. If you have questions about our Wednesday night programs, reach out to Emily Stothert and she'd be glad to give you more information. And for our Thursday night programs, you can speak with Roberta Simmons-Smith. Saturday, August the 24th kicks off our Korean 316 program. And this is not just for those who speak Korean. So this is for anybody who is interested in learning about and diving into the Korean culture. So if uh, that's something that piques your interest, please reach out to Captains Minky or Grace Kim and they would be happy to give you more information about how you can get involved in our Korean 316 program, which happens on Saturdays. We have mentioned previously that if you are interested in volunteering in any of our programs, you do need to do the Safe From Harm training. Uh, that will take place on Wednesday, August the 14th, and that'll be at 6.30 p.m., and Emily Stothert will be conducting that training. So again, if you're interested in uh, volunteering, or if you think you might be at some point through the program year, come on out to that training on Wednesday, August the 14th at 6.30 p.m., and you'll be set to go for whenever you're ready to volunteer. Just a reminder for our young adults in the room, those ages 18 to 35, you are invited to participate in a weekend up at Camp Grandview. This weekend is called Create, and it's an opportunity for you to share your voice in how you feel young adult ministry could be most effective here in the Georgia Division. The cost for that weekend is absolutely free, but you do have to register. So if you go to adminacamp.com, you'll find all the information you need uh, for that weekend weekend specifically. If you have more questions, please feel free to reach out to Melissa Powell and she can answer any questions you might have about that weekend specifically. We're excited to have our core officers back with us this week and Captain Jeremy is going to be starting a seven-part sermon series on Joseph. So we look forward to uh, hearing from him and hearing from God's Word. I pray that you've come ready to worship, ready to receive all that God has in store for you today. God bless you.